Hello, everyone. This is Sharif. Um, OpenMRS uh, software developer. So in this screencast, we are going to learn how to create um, a basic uh, OpenMRS how, how to create OpenMRS module using OpenMRS SDK. So with that, I'm going to start by creating having uh, a directory so I have any directory that uh, I'm going to use so my directory is called uh, which is in D so with that uh, we use uh, MVN open MRS CDK create project I'm going to share um, a link below in the screencast about um how you can follow up uh how to create uh how you can follow the so this is the chart it is on the wiki page so you can follow the procedures here and um it will guide you how to create uh your first module and then in this screencast we are going to push this module that we've created to the git repository say so that gives you the basic uh um that you have your module and to have the module on on um in the remote so with that um we use openmrs sdk create project then press enter <laughs> So SDK is going to create uh, our Bayer uh, architecture project that you can start customize according to your needs. And uh, as you continue, I may say that uh, you need to first set up the OpenMRS SDK. So there are a number of things that uh, you need to have when setting up OpenMRS SDK. I'm going to create the link. I'm going to share the link below how we can create, uh, we can set up an OpenMRS project on our machine. Uh, yeah, so uh, it when it reaches here and it have gave us, the OpenMRS SDK gave us the project uh, options. So in this time, I'm going to create an object that is going to run in the Rufus application version 2. So two is a Rufus application module. Then the basic name is going to be, I'm going to say patient, um, patient concepts, patient concepts. Then the module uh, name that is also uh, specify the module name. So it's going to be like that. Press enter description patient concepts for open MRS. So this is just uh, just a description that describes your module. Press enter. So uh, the group ID is org.openmrs.module. Uh, version I'm going to run on yeah on, on that snapshot 1.00. Um, yeah, this is the uh, the version that uh, the platform version that you are running currently for the Rufus application. So currently we are running on version 2.4 platform. So that is Rufus Rif up 2.11. So at this time of screencast, um, we are running on Rufus up 2.11. So I'm going to use the same the same. Uh, the same version of platform. So, yeah, I've successfully created uh, OpenMRS a project using OpenMRS SDK. So, yeah, we've successfully created. From here, um, we are going to push our 
project to to the remote to the git repository so by that by that i'm going to first um first uh, go to that directory patient so from that i'm going to start the git in it uh, yeah after that i'm going to create a git repository I'm going to create a git repository. You go to your git account and create a git repository called let me give it the same name patient um, uh, I'm not going to add a description. Okay, I can add um, screen the patient Patient concept module um, for testing um, for creating patient concept module created by SDK. Open MRS SDK. Uh, it is public, it is not private, so uh if it is your first time git means uh, public means anyone on the internet can access it then private uh, it is private no one can access it you can add add me read with me you can add the git you know but in this screencast i'm not going to i'm not going to add um not add them so you create your repository by clicking create repository button so um, yeah, we've uh, uh, now created uh, uh, our project called Patient Concepts, and then uh, basically we we'll create uh, this one, this repository to get uh, this link, say that we can sync with it with our local instance that we've already created using OpenMRS SDK. So with that. Um, I'm going to let me try to. I'm going to say git remote add origin add origin. So adding origin means I'm adding this remote this URL to sync with this our project locally. So I'm going to copy this and I paste here is I paste it so I'm adding this remote this URL to my project okay yeah so I press enter um so we've added so you can say you can first check by saying e us uh git add let's add let's add all now if you said git status, so they say on the branch master and your commit says untracked files. So let's add these untracked files. So if you want to add all, you just say git add space, then positive. Press enter. So when we say git status, so it have already uh, they have been added to our git. So we can commit. And commit as our first commit first test first testing okay first commit so from here we've committed uh, we've uh, committed our changes and we are ready now to push them to the remote so we we'll do that by saying git push you origin origin master so the master is our remote url that we've synced to or oh, we've added so this is how we can push so let's press enter and wait a bit okay so 
I'm logging in in my GitHub account. Sometimes it helps. It Git always behaves like that. So feel free to log in again. Yeah, so we've uh, we've pushed um, our remote, our local uh, project to the remote. So by uh, checking that, we go to the remote, go to this project, and we press enter or you refresh. Yes, so we've successfully. Uh, pushed our first commit to the remote and we've successfully pushed uh, our local uh, project to the, the git repository so you need to first have the github account so that you can push um, your project to the remote uh, so this is how SDK, SDK gives you the basic, uh, how you create um, the basic architecture of creating the module uh, using the OpenMRS SDK API. Yeah, thank you guys for listening. I'm going to create, to share the link below of uh, OpenMRS wiki pages. You can find everything on OpenMRS uh, wiki page. Uh, you can uh, continue to create your module and uh, and your, with your preferences. If you have liked this video, like it and, and you can share it with your friends. Um, yeah, if you if there's something else that uh, that there, that there is uh, that you'd like me to, to 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 talk about, you can share it with me. Or if there's something that I've missed feel free to uh, add a comment below yeah thank you and nice time we meet